What's up guys? So it's the Amac Man and today I have something really really special for you. It's on how to get iOS 6 beta 1 for your iPhone, iPod Touch, iPad uh, or Apple TV on, uh, for free of course uh, without uh, having a developer uh, um, account or uh, having to register your UDID. So let's get started. First of all you need to download the, from this website IM, imzdl.com uh, the beta the IPSW for the iOS 6 beta so uh, you're gonna choose your device and gonna download here pretty easy and straightforward uh, this is uh, the torrent file download torrent and this is the download file and you're gonna choose uh, from uh, depending on what device you have so yeah I downloaded the iPhone 4 GSM because I have an iPhone 4 on GSM so then you're gonna have to download iTunes 10.6.3 uh, that's very very uh, um, important for this process and uh, you should make sure that it's iTunes 10.6.3 and you can see that uh, I'll show you in a bit so then you have to download the 5.1.1 uh, firmware for your respective device for example uh, mine is iPhone 4 so I'm gonna go down to iPhone 4 GSM 5.1.1 and gonna choose that so after you've downloaded uh, these three things you're gonna go to iTunes and then once you're on iTunes go to um, to see what, what uh, firmware of iTunes you have go to uh, iTunes and then preferences sorry about sorry yeah about iTunes and then you can see right here it's 10.6.3 so yeah once you've done that, you're gonna make sure you click uh, backup your iPhone or iPod Touch or iPad or Apple TV backup. So yeah, it's gonna take some time. It's actually not gonna take some time if you have already backed it up uh, recently. And then you should make sure to synchronize. As you can see from uh, my iPhone, I'm zooming in. I'm already on 6.0. Uh, uh, oops, sorry about that. I'm already on 6.0. Uh, um, my firmware, okay, anyway, like that. And then what you need to do is click on iTunes, go on iTunes, and click uh, Control. Let me zoom the. It's gonna zoom itself. So yeah, go on iTunes and click Option Restore, and choose the firmware you downloaded to uh, 5.1.1 first. Uh, be sure to click Restore, not Update. Uh, option Restore and click on 5.1, and uh, Restore. iTunes will raise and restore your iPhone to iOS 5.1.1, and will verify with Apple. Uh, with the restore, with Apple. Okay, restore it. I'm gonna extract software so I'm gonna pause that and be right back so what's up guys so I'm back from the restore of the uh, of my iPhone to 5.1.1 so let's go right here and set it up to for a new iPhone uh, actually set up as a new iPhone I'm gonna select right and uh, yeah I'm gonna check that for now because I don't need that uh, yeah, so. as you can see on my iPhone right there it's um it's on um, 5.1.1 that's the proof so once you've done that and again backed up so I'm gonna click option and check for update right now actually yeah option check for update and select the 6.0 firmware that, that you've downloaded from the web so we're gonna click option and click on update not restore but update at first you do the restore and then you click on update option restore and then option update so you're gonna click the iPhone uh, 3.1 anyway that's uh, the download itself so 6.0 what you've downloaded so click on that and uh, iTunes will update your iPhone to iOS 6.0 and verify the update with Apple so update extracting software for once again so uh, I'll be again back when this is finished and show you that um, uh, actually I'm gonna speed this up
starting the record because my camera reached its maximum 10 minutes of recording so you probably see it right there all the process I'm recording right now as you can see uh, it loaded up in my iTunes so as you can see it's running 6.0 as you can see it there and uh, so unlock it so I'm, go I'm not gonna let you see that so as you can see right there it's running um, 6.0 and uh, yeah so you can see it right there uh, it's um, I have passport which I can really do nothing with it right now and new maps with the 3d thing right there and uh, so basically that's it you're running 6.0 beta 1 and that's how you get for free and that's really simple and the only thing you need to download is the firmware and the IT uh, new version so that was it guys, so hope you enjoyed this vid uh, please stay tuned for more videos to come and be sure to subscribe above and uh, also let me know whether it worked for you or not and so yeah, peace